So, six days away from the Pixel announcement for the Pixel 6 and 6 Pro. Finally, 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 Google is going to take everything off and I already pretty much took everything off, but we're gonna finally see these devices in action, not in a leaked video, not still somewhere in the New York City shop. We're gonna actually see them in action at an event, and I can't freaking wait. So I wanna tell you guys a few quick reasons why I'm excited for the Pixel 6 and 6 Pro and why you should be too. If you are an Android lover, you should be excited for the 6 and the 6 Pro, and I wanna tell you why in this video. So let's go ahead and get into the intro. Now, what's up everybody? If you don't know who I am, I am Tech King Mike. Welcome back to another video. I like to talk about tech and I like to just kind of give you my perspective on things. So if you're new here, check out other videos. There'll be links in the description below. And hey, if you like what you see, hit subscribe while you're here and hit the like button. Helps me out. Helps me know that you like this type of content. That being said, let's go ahead and get into it. Reason number one why I am excited for the Pixel 6 Pro is the Tensor chip. Now, we can get into the nitty gritty of how the chip was designed, who's, you know, the architecture and everything behind it, but I wanna keep it nice and simple for you, right? Qualcomm is a mass manufacturer of chips. They literally make chips for so many different devices, but look at devices like Apple. Look at what they've done with their A chips that they have inside of their phones. Great battery life, optimization is always great. When you see the hardware and software from the same manufacturer like, like put together, you usually get magnificent beautiful results. Pixel giving us a tensor chip that is designed and created by them inside of their phones with their software. I can only expect great things, great battery life, AI optimization when it comes to the camera. Everything should be so smooth and so flawless with this device. I know I might be hyping it up a little bit, but I, I have high expectations for this because we've seen what Google can do with the mid-range Qualcomm chip. So I know they're gonna be able to do something special with these tensor chips. So I'm excited to see what these things are gonna do when they're really put to the test. Reason number two, why I'm excited for the Pixel 6 and the 6 Pro is I am expecting these cameras to be a freaking one. Now, what has Pixel always been known for? They've always been known for the cameras. Cameras have always been their strong suit. Still photography and even video. Some people will say it's not the best. Some people will say the iPhone beats it. I will say that the iPhone is king supreme when it comes to mobile video, but I will say that I think the Pixel is on the verge of catching up. And I'm curious to see with these new camera hardware that they're putting in, higher megapixel sensors, new software that's gonna be attached to it, optimization is gonna be incredible. I'm really excited to see where Pixel's gonna go with their cameras with these new devices. They're making a strong emphasis on the cameras. I mean, look at the design of the phone. It's really going to stand out. So I'm excited to see what they're gonna do with this. And the last reason, like I said, very quick, last reason why I'm excited for the Pixel 6 and the 6 Pro is Google is doing something different, right? Google is doing something new. Now, if you've never used the Pixel device before, if you've never used the, uh, the Pixel device before, now is the time for you to consider one. The Pixel 5a is an amazing phone at $450, and I have a video about that that I'll link somewhere up here, where you can kind of check out a few of my, uh, my first impressions on the device, and I still have the device, so check out a long-term review dropping on that one later on this week. But the Pixel 5a was an amazing $450 device. The Pixel 4a was an amazing $350 device. Pixel has always created great, solid phones, they just don't have that notoriety, that popularity that Samsung and Apple do because a lot of people hear Samsung and they think Android. But I'm here to tell you that you're sleeping on Google if you don't know about it. Now, the 6 and the 6 Pro are Google's chance and Google's effort to kind of reinvent themselves, kind of do something different, right? Google is really trying to come out of the game and say, hey, you guys wanted the Pixel flagship for years. You guys wanted a different type of Pixel. You didn't want that, util that totalitarian design. You didn't want all of this. Hey, we're gonna go ahead and give it to you. We're gonna give you a nice, amazing device. You're gonna get two different options and you're gonna pick the one that works best for you. We're throwing money into the marketing. We're throwing advertisements out there. I mean, call it leaks, call it whatever you want. We've been hearing about this phone all freaking year man i'm excited because i'm ready to finally see what these things can true truly do so google is really in i think a lot of people are getting confused google is in competition with no one but themselves and now if if you've never used the pixel device if you're an android fan and you've never used one like i said at the beginning of the video now is the perfect time to check one out because i don't think you're gonna get a better opportunity to step into google pixel and see what you're gonna get now that being said, October 19th is the date. So we are six days away as of the recording of this video from the Pixel 6 and the 6 Pro being announced. We're gonna actually get to see them presented on stage, talked about, and I, for one, 
can't wait. I have my phone set to listen and record. I probably will be at work or maybe at home, but I will be watching or listening front and center when it happens. But that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end it right here. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Are you excited for the Pixel 6 and the 6 Pro? Are you looking forward to grabbing one? If you are, what color are you getting? I'm, I'm torn between that cloudy white or that black and that silver combination, man. I don't know which one I'm going to go with, but one of those two will be in my pocket. But with that being said, man, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you see you back on the next one. Stay safe. Enjoy your day. Have a good one.